What's up, everyone? I'm Coach D. So I have a question for you guys. When do you guys think Donald Trump will stop being a national embarrassment? He went to Georgia today for a photo op and to lie about Joe Biden and to take advantage of a hurricane that had just devastated the area. Yes, Donald Trump went to Georgia to try and score political points on the backs of people in need in the state of Georgia. Everyone knows that it's a bad idea for politicians and popular people to visit places that have just been devastated because it sucks up the resources that could be used for people in need. But that doesn't stop Donald Trump from going somewhere for a photo op and to lie through his teeth. Donald Trump literally said that the governor of Georgia couldn't get in touch with Joe Biden. And since the federal government wasn't doing anything, he was there to help out. At the exact same time, the governor of Georgia was standing at a podium telling everyone that he had spoken with Joe Biden the day before. Here's the proof. We, we do need some help from the federal government. They have to get together, ideally with the governor. The governor needs to, uh, He's been trying to get them, and uh, I'm sure they're going to come through. But uh, he's been calling the president, hasn't been able to get him. If the federal government is not being responsive, but they're having a very hard time getting the, uh, getting the president on the phone. So I, I just spoke. The president just called me uh, yesterday afternoon. I missed him and called him right back. And he just said, hey, what do you need? And I told him, you know, we, we got what we need. We'll work through the federal process. He, he offered that if there's other things we need, just to call him directly, which I appreciate that. But there's not a single person who is surprised that Donald Trump is a liar and that he showed up in Georgia for a photo op. This is what he does. And you have a bunch of MAGAs out there who are posting this and saying, where's Joe Biden? Where's Kamala Harris? Every single governor of every single state has been devastated, has said, we will let people know when it's appropriate for them to come here because right now we're trying to use all of our resources for the people who are in need. But again, that does not stop Donald Trump from trying to get a photo op. Here's Governor McMaster also saying that he has spoken with Joe Biden and they have been given every resource that they need. So this is a great, a great team effort. And I assure you it, it's going to be done, but this is one that is going to take a lot of patience. We, we got the team, we have the equipment, the federal government is helping us well. They're, they're, in, they're in embedded with us and uh, there's no asset out there that we have not already accessed. Again, Joe Biden has responded to every single person who is in need. He signed declarations to make sure there would not be any types of delay in resources before the hurricane actually hit. And every single governor is saying that's what's happening. But Donald Trump is out there lying. And Joe Biden was asked about this. And I have to empathize with him and what he said, because he basically said Donald Trump is just lying. I don't know why he does this, but this is what he does. We all know why he does. He wants to be president because he's trying to stay out of jail. But I digress. Joe Biden said he's lying. And then he said, I don't care what he says about me. I care about the message he's sending to people in need. That is a profound statement because if Donald Trump had any dignity, he would not be standing there lying to people who are watching television, probably waiting to hear the, the good news about resources coming or about help or whatever. And Donald Trump is telling them that their president is doing nothing for them. So I really like that Joe Biden called a spade a spade and did not mince words in what he said. Here. Mr. President and, uh, and Governor Cooper, Donald Trump has, a, has accused both of you of ignoring uh, the disaster. He is lying. Let me get this straight. He's lying. And the governor told him he was lying. The governor told me he was lying. I've spoken to the governor, I've spent time with him, and he told me he's lying. I don't know why he does this. And the reason I get so angry about it, I don't care about what he says about me, but I care what he, what he communicates to the people in the, that are in need. He implies that we're not doing everything possible. We are. We are. And you, and you, you spoke to the governor, I assume you heard the Republican governor of Georgia talk about that he was on the phone with me. 
more than once. So that's simply not true, and it's irresponsible. Donald Trump is a liar, an opportunist, and a national embarrassment. He should have never been president the first time, and we better make damn sure he's never president again. Period.